Hey guys, um, I actually had a, a question from a client of mine, a seller about appraisals. And I also get this question a lot from buyers. So I figured I'd just share it with you um, and uh, just yeah, share some additional insight. Um, the whole thing on an appraisal is an appraisal is an independent third party's opinion um, of the value of the property based on that day and um, market facts or statistics of what's happening and what's recently sold. Um, if a property doesn't appraise, there's one of three things that can happen. Um, the buyer can cancel if they have an appraisal contingency. I'll get into contingencies on another video, so stay tuned for that. Um, the seller can say, no, I'm not going to reduce it, uh, the purchase price. You agreed to pay this price. And then the buyer would have to come in with more money. Or um, a lot of times what happens, assuming the buyer does have um, some additional funds to come in, uh, they might meet somewhere in the middle. Um, negotiating between what the appraised price is and what the uh, the original purchase price was. Um, so those are different scenarios. Obviously, there's um, each individual transaction has a completely different seller and a different buyer. So everything is really um, subject to a lot more intricacies. But that's just a general idea. I'm always here to help if you have any specific questions, and I'll catch you later. Thanks.